You are the red. That's her point. I grew up like a tomboy. My name was Genghis Khan, and that way I was able to hang outside, and people didn't know. I could always face the front wall, and after that I fell in love with squash. Your swing shouldn't start here. Your swing shouldn't start here. Can I go to a time? Squash lesson. So I grew up like a tomboy. My name was Genghis Khan, and that way I was able to hang outside, and people didn't know. I could always face the front wall. First sport that I started was weightlifting. That way, it does not lose the sight of the ball. And after that, I fell in love with squash. If you swing, your swing shouldn't start here. Your swing shouldn't start here. Your swing shouldn't start here. It should always, the two eyes should be looking at the front wall, because squash is such a huge sport in Pakistan, and uh, uh, we had uh, many, many world champions in men's. So when I saw the, the beauty of the sport, the rackets, the clothing style, the stamina and the, and the determination behind that, I wanted to play squash and, you know, today I'm a professional squash player and re represent Pakistan all over the world. Arm should be L-shaped, the wrist should be cocked, and then from there it comes the body. I used to look at boys, how they train, how they play, and then I used to get on court and try to figure it out on my own, do the same kind of drills by myself. And I kept learning that way. And then, in, you know, with time, I also got into camps, you know, national camps that, you know, made me better. This is the actual squash ball. It's a soft ball. That's what they call it in, uh, here in North America. And um, you have to know if it has one dot, it's a little uh, you know, faster. And if it has two dots, that's actually the professional squash. You know, when you play, you always use uh, two double yellow dots. Yeah. You have to hit it hard to make it warm, and then it would start bouncing a little. That line in the middle is called service line. So whenever you serve, you serve above that line. If it hits below that line, it's out. You know, I have a lot of memories definitely from my childhood and how I ended up in sport. This is all I feel like a miracle for me. Um, you know, coming from the tribal areas and playing sports and then today I'm sitting here among you, among the Western people. It's all kind of a miracle for me. And from the back end, the same thing. So you see, when you hold this racket like this, it's cocked wrist, you see? But if you move like this, or you move like this. You see, the racket never changes. I love squash and it gave me kind of life. I understand squash, I, I see squash as, a, as life. You, when, once you get on squash court, you can actually um, find a whole life in there. Uh, how to when, to, when to be defensive, when to be attacking, how to behave.